Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Yes, I am getting sick, so excuse if I sneeze like a bunch of times. You too. Junior's getting sick too. If I start sneezing like crazy, oh my god, I feel like another one's coming. I just finished sneezing like crazy and ugh. anyways, I wanted to do the get to know your YouTuber tag. I haven't done a tag in a long time and I feel like I really don't come on here and have a conversation and have a full-on conversation with you guys it's not that I want to it's just it's hard for me to do it when I am trying to take care of the kids and then junior is really hard so but yeah I wanted to do this video and I'm going to be answering 15 questions I have no idea what the questions are I haven't even looked at them but I'm about to look at them now so question number one is what is your name my name is Grace Sandoval um, so yeah what is your age I was born July 11 1987 so my birthday I'm a cancer you guys it is I am 28 years old yeah are you single married divorced if married for how long I am married yeah I've been married I am married you guys and I've been married for I want to say I'm going for eight years but I've been together for 11 yeah so it's been a long time next question is do you have any children yes I do if you guys know I do have three children here's one say hi yeah oh my god oh my god I'm gonna sneeze right now seriously horrible horrible i do have three kids i have um amy who is 11 Haley that is seven and junior that is three. Oh my god my eyes watered i really wanted to sneeze you guys booty 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 all right next five how long have you been on youtube and do you have any other youtube channels you're not gonna let me do this are you can i have a kiss Love you. Ooh, my eyes water. Number five says, how long have you been on YouTube and do you have any other YouTube channels? I have been on YouTube since 2008 and I've been on YouTube for a while. And I do have another YouTube channel. It is my blog. It's Pretty Little Miss Grace. I'll leave it down below if you guys want to go ahead and check that out. What it says, what does your username mean? Um, pretty obviously pretty little because I'm short and then Miss Grace my name so yeah you get that you get what I'm going yeah all right what is your channel about that's number seven my channel is about mostly makeup tutorials I've been trying to kind of expand and do um, outfits of the day um, hair tutorials try to talk a little bit more hopefully for next year I can start doing that but I'm mostly my channel is mostly about beauty mostly about makeup what number eight what and who inspired you to make videos honestly I was just bored at home didn't know what to do and then I saw one of my friends um, who was looking on YouTube for videos and I'm thinking man I can do that at home that would be fun so I just instantly just started doing youtube videos number nine what is the best thing about youtube the best thing to me is for, for youtube is when i get to go to events and i get to see the people that follow me i think that's the best thing i love seeing people every year um that i've seen years before i recently became really good friends with um two ladies um the mom and the daughter I, I would see them every year, the mom and the daughter, and now we have like became good friends and now we kind of see each other almost every weekend, we kind of go out and do family things. The mom and the daughter, I've seen them every year, mostly every event. Um, uh, I've just seen the daughter grow up and I'm like, every time I see her, I'm like, dude, you got to stop growing, man, because you're even taller than me. So I think making friends is the most thing that I like about YouTube. Getting to meet all of you guys is like the best thing that I think from YouTube has for me. The next question is, what is the worst thing about YouTube? 
the worst thing about YouTube is the criticism you get online because you are putting yourself out there for other people to opinion about you or say anything negative that they have to say or criticize you. That's like the most negative thing. I remember when I just started, I would get so much out of it that I would want to quit and not do it anymore. But you have to grow thick skin and you just got to move on. So that's what I kind of do. Number 11, what do you wish you would have known before you started? Oh my god. I don't know how much money you have to put into YouTube. I wish I would have known because I feel like every year I am putting more money. I spent more money on lighting, on camera, on lens, on the desk, on makeup, on things that I need for my YouTube clothes, shoes, all that good stuff, I do need to put money, invest in YouTube so I can um, do what I'm doing now. I wish I would have known that that's what you have to do because honestly, I didn't know what I was getting myself into. Let's see, number 12. Do you, do any of your family members or friends know you have a YouTube channel? My family all knows I have a YouTube channel. When I started, I first kind of like didn't like people to know that I was doing a YouTube channel. I still don't like it. Like, not not in a bad way. Um, I don't like, let's say, for example, I'm with my mom. and She'll tell people, oh, my daughter does YouTube videos. I don't like when she does that. Or when my daughter does it, it tells everybody, oh, my mom is a YouTuber and her name is Pretty Little Miss Grace. <laughs> Excuse me. I don't know why I don't like it, but... I just don't I don't know it's weird but all of my family knows and my friends so mostly all the people that I know in person know that I do YouTube videos so yeah number 13 where do you see yourself in five years if you guys hear Jerry he's down here playing I don't know what he's doing he's playing mechanic I guess um, in five years I'm hoping that YouTube becomes like a job for me that I can live off because ooh, junior careful you almost dropped the camera that it can become a job for me because honestly, right now I cannot live off YouTube. I honestly have to do works on the side so I can actually make ends meet. So I'm hoping that in five years from now I become really successful on YouTube and I can live off YouTube, to be honest with you guys. Number 14, what message are you trying to get across in your videos? Honestly, my main one is that even though I have children and I'm a mom and I'm a wife, I can still have time to get myself ready and look good. I have a lot of mothers of YouTube commenting me, messaging me, ask me, how do I do it? How do I make time for myself to do videos, to do my makeup, to get ready? Because they have two children, they have one child, they cannot do it and I have three. Am I, yeah, you can drink it, baby. Yeah, it's good. Um, I just want them to know that it's okay that you're a mom. It doesn't mean that you have to let yourself go and not fix yourself and get ready just to feel pretty. I mean, I honestly do it for myself. I don't do it for my husband. I don't do it for anybody. I like looking good. I like looking pretty. And yeah, so that's kind of my message that I want everybody to know that, you know, you can always take five minutes of your time just to get yourself ready. Let's see, any advice for the new YouTubers? If I have any advice for the new YouTubers, I want to say you have to have thick skin for this because it's not really easy and a lot of patience. I honestly don't have any patience. Um, I've been on YouTube for a while and I still am not where I wish I could be. I've seen people that just started YouTube maybe a, couple, uh, maybe a year ago or something and they already are where I want to be. But I think it takes time. Um, whenever it's going to be your time to shine, then that's when it's going to happen. So I try not to rush it. And I do sometimes get frustrated. But hey, we got to have patience. Thick skin, you guys. Because a lot of people are harsh out there. And they will do and say horrible things. So that's about it. I really hope you guys enjoy this quick little um, get to know your YouTuber a little bit more. I honestly don't know what else to say. I love you guys and I want to thank you guys again for watching and stay tuned for more videos. And don't forget to thumbs up. Follow me on my Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. That's Jenny's little thumb. Thumbs up. And yeah, 
I want to thank you for watching and talk to you guys soon. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Say bye. Bye.